My engineering degree, super technical, you know, really prepared me well for a job in the field engineering. And then I also had this oyster farm business. I think back on this kind of foundation that we developed at UMaine at the Foster Center is like how to run a business. Being able to go to the Foster Center, get you know one-on-one -on -one personal business advice every week, it really complemented things. There's just like a hub at the school that kind of pairs students with these internships, get you these opportunities that like, I had never even thought about the aquaculture industry. So I think it's kind of good to be able to apply what I've learned through here to kind of help keep our, our industries alive. Growing up in Maine, I took it for granted for several years. I went to school outside of Maine for a while. And then when you come back, you realize how special Maine truly is. And I wanted to find a way to stay here and work, and I especially wanted to work on the water. And that's something that's tough in Maine right now. So the aquaculture industry has really provided jobs for younger people, and it's, it's an industry that's let people stay in Maine and work on the water. I think aquaculture is a way that you can have some stability and you can really count on there being a future and to protect this kind of way of life. This kind of transition, I think, that's happening here in Maine is a precedent for what we're gonna see happen in the rest of the country. It is a really fun kind of intersection of tradition and new ideas, I think.